Welcome back, survivors. Luke Allen here, and we are freaking back with more days gone. Days gone. Welcome back, everyone. Today, we're gonna start this episode with a mission. We're gonna start with a story mission. We're gonna do a mission with Sarah or for her. We're gonna see what's this mission. We're gonna start this with a little bit more story because the story is just it's, it's good. It's good. It's good pepperoni. Good pasta. Good pasta. I will say it's, it's very nice. Very nice. I like it. I like it. But let's see what, 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 what do we got on our hands. <sighs> well, that's it. That's as far as I can go. How can I help? You can't, unless you have a DNA synthesizer somewhere. No, but uh, there's an auto parts store near Fort Klamath that I could check out. you can't get what I need there, you... God, you think I would learn? I actually think I know where you'd get one. Hmm. Really? Yeah, your old lab, Cloverdale. Okay, yeah, that's great. All we have to do is find a way over the mountains. Yeah, oh! Possible. My God, you know a way over, don't you? Good, you can take me. Is that an order, Lieutenant? Yes. Oh! No, what I'm I mean, no, it's not an well, order. Which is it? Well, I don't know. Are you going to take me or not? Dress warm, pack light. Hey, Deke. Oh, my God. If you say thank you one more time, I. Ooh! <laughs> There's still love in the air, guys. There is Let still love in the air. That makes me quite happy. Good, good, good. Okay, okay. I thought this was gonna be one of those things because there was no more. Going somewhere, Lieutenant? Colonel, Captain. Ooh. Yes, we're heading out to retrieve a piece of equipment that I need. I see. How is your work progressing? Good, good. With D Corporal St. John's help, I've been able to make some good progress. Thank you for assigning him to my project. Well, Lieutenant Weaver's also been making progress. Hmm. He says he'll be ready to test his chemical weapon by the end of the week. Oh. I heard. Mine will be ready soon. Oh. You realize you are more valuable than any piece of equipment. Equipment can be replaced. You cannot. I've been in a ship before, Matt. You know that I can handle myself. Carry on, Lieutenant. Okay, that's weird. He, 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 just, he just let her go. I'd like to see Weaver's equipment. Something's gonna happen, eh? Something's gonna happen. I feel like something's gonna happen. Hmm. I don't want to say, but I think they're gonna try to kill us. They're gonna send someone to kill us. Just saying, that feel kind of weird because he didn't press on. He what didn't is press that her. all about, anyway? Yeah. What? All the yes sirs and no sirs and the saluting hmm. and the ranks and the uniforms just seems kind of pointless, you know? Considering. Hey, you were in the army once. You should know. That was different. Hmm. How? Oh, there were more people in the world. I don't know. I mean, having a military made more sense. I think mm -hmm. it makes more sense now. Why? It's utter fucking chaos out here. We yeah. need the order and discipline or we're not going to make it. You know, I've been in plenty yeah. of camps that are doing just fine without having a colonel breathing down their necks. You know what's funny? About uniforms and ranks seeming pointless, I mean. Oh, what? I used to think the same thing about the MC. Oh. I mean, you guys had ranks like road captain and president. I mean, you wore badges and patches and, and tats like uniforms. I mean, when you guys used to all ride together, you looked like an army. Well, mm. except for beards and bikes. Yeah. Now that you've mentioned it, I, I can see your point. Uh, yo, I'm actually check surprised me. Check you were me. wearing the cut when you came into the camp. I didn't think anything would make you give that up. Even the end of the world. Okay, so my cut, huh? We're gonna have to see if the colonel will let me switch uniforms. You know, there is that. Where are we heading? To Diamond Lake. There's an old forest service road that winds around the western base of Mount Tielsen. <gasps> okay. No way. No Was way. Was that here when you came over the pass? Yeah, but the soldiers stationed there were having uh, bear problems. Oh, bear no. Problems. No way. No way. Hey. We're going. Hey! Shut it off! You're gonna have to turn around, buddy. We got orders to keep anyone from- To keep anyone from what, Corporal? I'm um, sorry, ma'am, I didn't see it was you. It's, it's the Colonel, ma'am. He's given us orders to keep an eye out for anyone going AWOL. Are you accusing me of going AWOL? No, ma'am. Then get out of my way. <sighs> Corporal, what are you still doing there? Get the hell out of my way. Yes, ma'am. I'm sorry, ma'am. Oh, they're going to think we're going to go AWOL, maybe. I'll have to report this. Yeah, you do that. Oh. Well, that sounds serious. What do you mean? 
Well, he oh. said he's going to report you. I mean, how's Matt going to take that? The colonel will tell him to mind his own fucking business and to never question an officer. Ooh, something's going to happen. I'm just going to say something's going to happen. Something's bad is going to happen. Oh I'm not God. even controlling this. What's wrong? Nothing. It's just... I mean, the view up here, it, it's incredible. I'm not driving. Yeah, I guess I just don't see it anymore. Uh, pay attention to it, I mean. How can you not? It's it's breathtaking. Yeah, the world wakes up, grateful for another dawn. Hey, if you spent all day staring into a microscope, you might appreciate it more. Oh, I appreciate it. I'm not going to lie, this is quite interesting. Being around when the morning comes up is a hell of a lot better than the alternative. I got to be honest. You know, there were times when I didn't believe that about... You know, hoping to see another day? Yeah, I know the feeling. What kept you going? I mean, back then. Mm. Uh, I, I don't know. Just, it's uh, crazy. We're going to go to Diamond Lake. Damn stubborn to give up, Are I we think. really going to go to... I don't believe you. Oh, my God. I didn't give up, Sarah. I did. And then, I, I don't know. Boozer's arm got fucked up. And I had to... I, I, I mean, I wasn't going to let him die, you know? So, mm -hmm. watching him struggle to keep going when he had no reason no fucking reason at all mm -hmm. I guess I didn't want to I didn't want to let him down so I, I didn't want to go out that way and then I found out that that you were still alive in that that's that's when I really wanted to that's when I really wanted to kill myself <laughs> right no seriously but uh then I remembered you still had my mongrels ring that's that's what kept me going. Figured I'd look you up, get it back. But you know how that turned out. Shit. Exactly. Things are gonna get better, you know that, right? Yeah. That's a yeah. weird story to say that we he wants his win ring. This thing, Deacon. We can. Are you trying to convince me or you? That's weird. Okay. 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 We're back where we where we did left mad. Not mad. What's the name? We must be getting close, right? Yeah, no. we're coming up on the Tealson Tunnel. Uh, I forgot the old man's name. Man, uh, try to remember, Covenant. What's the name of the old man? The guy down the the lake. Oh, damn lie. Oh, is it Lost Lake? I don't remember. What's his name? What is his son of a gun of a name? Oh, he's she's gonna see the shit of the Rippers. You need your help to move that out of the way. My God, what the hell is that? That is a sigil. It's a warning sign from the Rippers. You s What's a Ripper? Rippers. Rest in peace. They were a cult. They cut themselves. They worshipped the freaks. They wanted to be like them. And, um, <laughs> you could see what happened if you didn't want to be like them. How do we deal with them if we run into them? There's none. I'm going to run into them. You can help me move this or what? Yeah, sure. We kill them, but we, we literally destroy them. I wonder who put that there. All right, all right, all right. He's a page. Let's get back to the bargain, Barbara. All right, all right. I'm trying to remember the name of the guy. I forgot his name. Uh, I don't know. I don't want to say Matt because that's the name of the corn, no? Uh, what the frick is his name? I forgot his name. Wow, okay. Well, I think it's something that just happens, right? Okay, hang on. This is gonna be a tight squeeze. Jesus. No wonder everyone gave up their cars. This yep. is nothing. There's a tunnel up in the old Belknap oh, Road that she's Boozer gonna see and the I whole destruction the time. Traffic had been backed up at a Nero checkpoint for about a mile when everything got overrun. Sounds horrible. I seem worse, but yeah. Hey, this looks familiar. Yeah, yeah, it's right up here. Oh, we're not even going over there, okay. That's sad. I thought we were gonna go all the way with it to through the camp, but I don't know why. Oh well, it is what it is. I think. Wow. It's still working. I thought I'd see this place again. It's still functioning. What? What? Everything's still working. Okay. All right. The power's still on. Yeah, it doesn't surprise me. There's a solar array on the main rooftop. I think I also heard rumors about a nuclear-powered generator, but I never saw it. Huh. Okay, well, how the hell are we going to get in? She has her card. I'll show you. Oh, numbers. You said power's still on, right? 
Sarah Irene Whitaker, ID 2007659. Ooh. Welcome back to Cloverdale Research Iron Butte facility. It has been 751 days since your last login. Please wait. 751 days. are a little more high tech than I remember. <laughs> it's not really that impressive. Aerie's not intelligent. She's like a souped up smartphone app. Aerie? Artificial intelligence response interface. Hmm. They just made a word up. <clears throat> oh my god. What is it? Nothing. It's... What the hell? Look at this. There's so much food here. Sarah, this should be it, it, It's the and... irrigation system. It's all self-automated. So oh. as long as the power's on, this is self-sustaining. Oh, wow. Well, shit. This place has everything. It's got food. It's got water. It's got power. It's got a big fucking fence. I'm surprised no one is uh, camped out here. Well, it's like you said. The power's still on. That's... 8,000 volts telling everyone to keep the fuck out. I feel like there's someone here. <gasps> See? Come on! I feel like someone's in here. I really do feel it. I don't know. It's too... It's too convenient. It's too easy. Oh. <sighs> <laughs> too convenient. Someone's gonna point a gun at us. No. Oh, shit! The crows! Oh, get down! Get down! Oh, the criers! We never found the criers on this uh, in this area. Go, 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 go! Oh, we got a cryer problem. Oh, this is so bad. Ooh. Oh no. Ooh. Okay. Wow. They're infected. It's what's made them so hyper-aggressive. Makes them a pain in my ass. I think we should be okay as long as we're quiet. Okay. Okay. Maybe that's why also people haven't tried to go in, because that looks like horrible to try to go in there. Looks like a bad experience. I'm just going to say that. Hmm. What the hell happened here? I don't know. Why? Shots? People died inside their cars? What? There's people just dried up. They shot themselves? Oh, bullet wounds. Sarah. These, uh... These people all worked here, right? Did you know them? Yeah. Yeah, okay, why are they all dead? Let's go, come on. Okay, I'm curious now. Why are all the people that were working here died? So someone shot them all as they were what? Trying to leave? I mean, oh! Like and then they just locked the place up tight and they left. Why would they do that? I don't know. Do There's someone here. There's someone I here. here. We got the security guard, that corrupted security guard. I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm going to take him down. Take the freaking down. Skish. Okay. Sarah Irene Whitaker, ID 2007659. I'm ready, I'm ready. Shit. This one's not working. Come on, there's another one over here. I'll break it. I'll break it. I'll break the glass. So, okay, so why is, um, what'd you call it? Airy? Why is Airy working at the front gate and not the front door? Honestly, I'm surprised she's working at all. I remember the guys in the IT mm. department. Constantly complaining about the system going down, and th that was with weekly. That's interesting. And <laughs> now it's been what two years? Oh, that's interesting. Two years without well, they had weekly maintenance. That's interesting. So that means there is someone here that it's it's foreshadowing what's gonna happen. We all know it. Oh man, okay. I'm quite I'm ready. I'm freaking ready. Ready, Freddy. That one's working. Damn it! I, I don't understand why these aren't working. Cameras are Sarah, working. What? You know how you said that no one could get in here? Yeah. Why? You guys are someone watching. I'm already here. Oh. Motherfucker! 
my god, you're right. They've locked me out. Hey! Hey, let us in! We're not here to hurt you, and we're not here to stay! Let us in! Oh, is there another way in? Oh, we're gonna, we're gonna yeah. force our way in there. Yeah, I've got an idea. Come on. Mmm. There's no. a fire escape in the back of the maintenance building. But why won't they have that locked out, too? We don't know that they've locked out anything. I mean, it's probably just a glitch. The emergency exits can't be locked. I don't know, They're man. part of Cloverdale's safety protocols. Locked out? Not electronically, but maybe they put a lot of shit on it. I would say that's a lot of food. That is a lot of corn for one freaking person. Here, this is it. Just eating corn does not sound very nice. Oh, it's easy, but hold on. Hold on. Uh, there we go. The latch. There we go. Good shot. You done that before? Yeah, Many times. Okay, take out the cameras. I don't want no one to see me without my permission. That's gonna suck for him. He's gonna be like, taking down my cameras. And I'm like, hell yeah. You don't need cameras, man. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know about this. Why don't you let me go in first? I, I don't know what happened back there in the parking lot, but I'm telling you, there's no way anyone could have gotten in past this fence. I know these people. And if Jim's in there, he's gonna let Jim, us in. Jim? Jim, the rent -a cop Jim? <sighs> Jim, who almost shot me when I tried to pick you Deacon, up. That was so long ago, and a lot's changed since then. <sighs> yeah, not for the better. Sarah Irene Whitaker, ID 2007659. Good afternoon, Sarah Irene Whitaker. Welcome back to Cloverdale Research Iron Butte Facility. It has been seven minutes since your last login. Please wait. See, I told you. Those other doors must have been bugged or something. Ready? I don't feel comfortable. <laughs> Get down. Mother You were saying? Yeah. Ooh, I knew it. This world has taught me one thing. Trust no one. Expect the worst. I'm beginning to see your point on that. Okay. Uh, sorry, guys. You stay up here and give me cover right fire. Do whatever you can. Distract. Got it. I'll signal you when it's clear. Security personnel to the maintenance building. Okay. Building. Take these guys out. That's a lot of corn just for you people. Get a clear shot. Will you shoot those goddamn speakers? Your voice is driving me fucking crazy. All right. With you there. Where are the speakers? Warning. Deadly force is authorized for use against all trespassers. Okay. Deadly force is authorized. Okay, okay. It's clear. Come okay. In. Okay, these are very interesting. Missing my shots. Missing all my shots. Oh, police. Oh, yeah, right. There's no police anywhere. So I wonder, one of these guys will be like the the cop, uh, I think. We gotta get up those stairs and through the sky bridge. Oh, easy, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Okay, not too bad, easy peasy. Okay, let's salute these guys up a little bit fast. Where's the speaker? I'm looking for the speaker. Oh, there's a speaker. Okay, easy. I feel like this. Deadly force is authorized for use against all trespassers. Let me give it a fast check. Yeah, these guys, um, I'm quite curious now if, if the security guard is going to be here or something like that. I don't know. Quite interesting. I'm just giving a fast check, see if we can find anything nice. That'll be quite nice. Oh, what the hell is that? Police, huh? Oh. There it is. Easy. Easy peasy. Reload. It's locked. Hold on. Sarah Irene Whitaker, ID huh. 2007. A lot of shots have been fired. Sarah Irene Whitaker, security has been breached. The Cloverdale facility is in lockdown. Repeat. Override, ID 2007659. Override. Security protocol Alpha 761. Oh, she always had power. Shut the fuck up already. They must not have locked out inner security. You ready? Okay. Yeah, this time, let me go in first. All right, all right, all right. Hey, this time? We go in together. Ooh, not bad. Shit. Snipers up there. I see him. Okay, he was too bad of a sniper. Just say that. Get in there. There's more of them. Who shot me? Who else shot me? Oh, I didn't see your brother. Okay. Get the loot, get the loot, get the loot. 
Because that's what we're talking about. We just want the freaking loot. Can I break those? Okay, no, that is uh one more time. Sarah Irene Whitaker, ID 2007659, mm. security override and Let's see if they have any other type of food. Just corn. Well, ready? Yeah. Okay, a lot of corn. Why am I Christian moving like that by itself? Wait! Well, like you said, it's changed. Stand down and you will not be All right. Oh, what is that? Virus research. What? Okay, we got some inf classified info. Okay, okay, they have a very nice room. They have power, they have everything. Shut the hell up. Thank you, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. We got a microscope. Same here. We got a, we got a camcoder. Oh. Taking this photo. Oh. They're waiting for us in the atrium. Well, we'll let them wait. They will see what's going to happen to them if they continue making us wait. Open it, let's try the door. open it, open it, I'm ready. Sarah I'm ready. Irene Whitaker, ID 2007659, security override and disable the fucking voice response. Alert. Access Alert. denied. This Sarah Irene Whitaker, alarm. your security Alert. clearance has been revoked. Oh. <laughs> see an IT administrator for assistance. Fucking bitch! Hey, hey, going in that way would have been a death trap anyway. Everybody oh. on the side of that door is aimed right here. We need a better plan. Oh. oh, yeah, you got one? I do. Uh, well, maybe. Maybe. Uh, like, is there a way to that rooftop from here? Oh, oh, oh. Uh, Over uh, here. Oh, I was at the right place. Oh, my God. I'm so smart. I'm a smart cookie. Okay, I'm a, a smart. You should be able to climb up to the roof from that uh -huh. AC unit. Uh -huh. All right. I mean, you should be able to climb up from there. Listen, I want you to go up there, lay down suppressing fire, keep their attention. When they're all looking up, I'm going to go in from here. I'm going to take them by surprise. Okay. Okay, yeah, that's a really good plan. But uh, there's, uh, there's one problem with it. What? What's that? The door's locked out, remember? I'll fix that. Oh, shit. Come on, come on, I have an idea. What? I can blow up. Blow up the fucking door. Make the dog up, boom, boom. That's the plan. Do you have any explosives in here? No, 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 no. No, no explosives. Put your hand on that reader. Oh. Wait, oh. Yes, I'm in. Okay, oh. Security, that's so smart. Codes. From this station, I can get you a temporary access code. All right, here's your ID code. Ready? Uh, yeah. Your full name and ID 5429009. You got that? Uh, five four two nine zero zero nine. Uh, is that right? Yeah, let's go. Alert. I would one hundred percent get that wrong. I, I, I would not remember that. I'm one hundred percent on it. I will not remember that. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, let's get let's get this over with. Do I have to Here, help her get up? I need you to help me up. Okay, okay. Okay. Okay, okay. Yeah, okay, okay. Give me the option to help you. Oh, okay, okay. Get up here, get up here. Ready? Yeah. Okay, okay. You got it? Easy. <sighs> yeah. All right, all right, all right. I get their attention, then you go in. Hey, Alert. don't take any Alert. chances. Oh. Okay. Okay. Okay, go. Okay, okay, okay. Hey. What? What? Can I open it? Can I open the freaking door? Something's out here. Alert. Alert. Can I open the door? Men's coming! Under fire! Get down! 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 Get What's happening? What's happening, boys? What's happening, boys? What's happening, guys? You're getting your ass handed to you? Yeah, I'm, I'm killing y'all. I'm killing all of you. I'm, I'm taking you down. Wait here. I'll bring him to you. Ooh, oh, is he locked in? I think he's locked in. Oh my god, that's so funny. 
That's so funny. He's locked in, I think, inside the office. Hands! Don't shoot! Hands! Don't shoot! I give up! Get give up. up! Don't shoot him! We need him alive! Oh, God damn it! I said hands! Uh, all right. Ooh. All right, just, just tell me what you want. Okay. All Ooh, right. military. He's clean! We were just defending ourselves. Get down there. Oh, yes. All the dead people outside, Jim. You know, the ones you shot in the head. Ooh. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh! I mean, what was it, huh? What were they trying to do? Get home to their families? Maybe bring them back here? Ooh. You didn't want that, did you? Hmm. <laughs> Just good take the risk. <laughs> Gotta take him down. Ooh, no, no, no. Get up. I kind of feel like I'm not talking too much today. I don't know why. It's just so interesting. Oh my god, I can't. Don't make me. Jim, I'm gonna count to three. No, 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 no. One. You don't understand. Two. Look, don't do this. Three. What's happening? Open the goddamn door. All right, all right. What's gonna happen? Is there a breaker in there? There's something in there. What's that? Oh. I hope you know what you're doing. Thank you, Jim. Shoot him. Yes, we know what we're doing. Shoot him. You don't have to do this. Shoot him. Go. Shoot him. I'm sorry. Shoot him. We just can't take the risk. Ooh, Deacon is in love right now. Come on. I want to get the hell out of here. He's like, what the hell happened to my woman? She, she just got some store, cold heart killing machine right there, man. Like, wow. That's crazy. We got a whole laboratory now. Access to us. It's all true. I didn't want to believe it. The virus was made here. What are you talking about? The virus was made here. God, this is my fault. She made the virus. Oh, I just made that up, but oh my God. I, I don't understand. You should fault. have seen it when it first went in. No way. I mean, we used to grow wild ginger and, and grape root here. And then all of this changed. They sealed everything off. They took away my clearance. God, David kept telling me. He kept telling me that something was wrong. Okay, okay. Who's who's David? Sorry. David Gorman. He was this research intern. You know what I said? I told him that we're a farm and we're we're high tech and all that shit, and that there are billions of dollars at stake, and to just leave it alone. Then he didn't listen. He hacked the system. He got behind the firewall. He told me that this was some sort of classified. Project or something. I don't know. Project. Just he, slow wanted, down and... he wanted to be the next Edward Snowden. You see, he wanted to blow the lid off of this entire thing. David Gorman exposes the evil empire and saves the world and all that shit. Mm -hmm. And I didn't listen to him, Deacon. I told him that he was being paranoid. And he must have broken in here and then gotten some sample of whatever the hell they were cooking in here. Well, why? I don't understand. What do you mean? I pieced it together myself a little while later. The night that I was stabbed, I, I went to the Cloverdale office in farewell, and I went to, to go try and find David, but he was already gone. He'd hmm. been gone for two weeks. There was this big green expo in Portland. He must have gone to see a reporter. He was probably infected, and he didn't even know it yet. Oh, my God. No. And two days later, two days later, everybody at that conference was infected. And then they all got on planes and they went home. And a week later, two and a half billion people were dead. Sarah, this isn't, this couldn't be your fault. I mean, you couldn't have stopped. Oh, you Lord. don't understand. It's, it's the research. My research was a part of this. Deacon, I was a part of this. They, they used me. Damn. That's crazy. That's crazy. We made the virus. 
The virus okay. was made here. Uh, oh, hold on for a second. Uh, the electric fences, how would I turn them off? Uh, the power relays are in a building by the greenhouse is why. Oh, once we get okay. access to people. Um, it's just that there's a lot of food here, and I was thinking about radioing Boozer, letting him and Ricky know, letting Lost Lake Camp know. Do you think he could load that up? Yeah. Ooh, sure. okay. that's uh, nice of him. Ooh, that's very nice of him. That's very nice of Deacon. Sadly, we are going to have to leave it there. This was a great episode. We're kind of super long over the recording. I really do hope you enjoyed this fantastic episode. If you did, don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe. It helps a good son of a gun amount. It really, really does. Hope you join us in the next one. But until then, keep conquering, keep exploring, and most importantly, keep aiming. Farewell and ciao, ciao.